Welcome to TheAngiologist.com. A patient tells you that in a cold environment, their finger turns white, then purple, then red. What is this? This may very well be something called Raynaud's disease. You have to think about this in one of two ways. This is either a primary problem, in other words, they just have it, or it's a symptom of an underlying medical problem. How do we make the determination? First, figure out if the patient actually gets three color changes to their finger. White when it first gets cold, very pale. Then blue because there's no oxygenated blood in the finger, and then red as it rewarms, as the spasm goes away. If there are no other symptoms related to it, not painful, no trouble with uh, heartburn, no trouble with pulmonary disease, no kidney disease, no other systemic diseases. This may very well just be primary Raynaud's disease. You should do a normal, you should do a pulse exam and an Allen's test. Allen's test looking for intact artery circulation to the palmar aspect of the hand. So that's primary Raynaud's disease. If it's painful, if the patient has digital ulcers, if there's sclerodactyly or sausage-like digits, if there are systemic diseases make you, that should make you think about uh, secondary Raynaud's phenomenon, the most common diagnosis for that in the United States is CREST or scleroderma, CREST standing for calcinosis, Raynaud's, esophageal dysmotility, sclerodactyly, and telangiectasias. Always do a full physical examination. This is Ido Weinberg's angiologist.com.